Thanks to Martin for those early races at Cheltenham. Coming to the last race of the day at Cheltenham. And to Chase Fest, the five winners in. Oyet Sifler, Matt Cooper, Chardonnay Trail, James Shea, Disco Inferno, Matt Cooper, Is It Can a Drone, Hollywood, and uh, Gino oh, Molly Oscar. Just to find one is in. First of four under chases. One today, you at Cheltenham. Three tomorrow at Cedsfield for you. And It's a Can of Drone. Leads by about a length. And Disco Inferno wins second. Settling on down. And they jumped it. So both trainers here, Derek Inton has two and Matt Cooper has two. Both share top spot in the Inter's table of trainers with Alex Cherry, on, who doesn't have one in this, on three. Jim Shea, he's in this race, he's in second at the moment, he's on two. So let's chat. If James can win this, he could go to joint top with three of the trainers. Up the next one is there we go and you oh we lost one already and Nadia and Molly's gone for Derek Inton. Jump in the next in front of the big screen. They're gonna swing left hand didn't they love a mile and a half and a bit. Well a mile four and a half rounds left to run. And it's the kind of drum leads by two from his second place Chardonnay Trail on the inside of Urit Shufla. This going for no and then for halfway back mark with the four. So big day here at Cheltenham today. Uh last race of the day, Martin's gone to do some comms. Oh, he's gonna do the last two of the day. Alright. down. Jump in the next. They head towards it. It's a kind of drum that stretches lead to three to four from over at Shufla, jump in the ditch. Good jump in sec third, goal second, charging the trail, made ground through the air. And close right up now, disco in front of the jump in the next. Disco in front of a bit slower than the others, he lost a couple of lengths there. Mile left to run. It's a kind of drum by length and half to two from over at Shufla. Then Chardonnay trail on the inside, right behind is Disco Inferno, and there, oh, he seemed to lose the jockey just before he jumped that fence, did uh, oh, it's Shufla, but it's down to three now, and one train has one each now, so it's even things up for James Shea. It's a can of drone being pressed out by Disco Inferno, and neck away in second, two lengths away to Chardonnay trail. Heading that next, and they all jumped it safely. Past the five marker, and the leader is it's the kind of drum he's ridden along the oldest half length lead. He has over disco in front, seems to be going well in second. Coming under pressure, and through the Chardonnay trail, he's about three lengths off him, but he sat and closed up as he jumped that one. And the three of them are bunching up again, but it's this kind of drum looks the one that's beaten on the inside. He's ridden along. He's on your neck in front of Disco and Fruno, and length and half back in through Chardonnay Trail. He's swinging in, then they got two left to jump, and now Disco and Fruno's course has been given the office. He's gone, he's drawn the length clear from this kind of drill. We've got no answers in second. He jumped it slow, as did uh, Chardonnay Trail. He went into second now, but down towards that, Disco and Fruno, Jockey Dogs confident. He jumps it big and slow, and that's given a chance to Chardonnay Trail to close up. There's a length between them. They got a four and left, no up this up, there's one up. Here at Charlton and Disco and Freeman now stretching on again, length and half clear for Shardin the trail. They're well clear with the this kind of draw up to a line and Disco and Freeman is going to win by two lengths for Matt Cooper. And I'll take his score to four and he now be a top jockey, top trainer, sorry. Until tomorrow at least. A win for Disco Inferno. Beach Chardonnay Trail in second for James Shea and Hollywood's It's a Can of Drone, the only one to finish in third.